What's going on, you guys? It's me, Kiki Solano, welcoming you to BYUSN right now. Back in Studio B, where we finally have time to give our AD, Tom Homo, all the credit he deserves. Not to mention, we've got a social media roundup that has me feeling real excited about some new players and real jealous about the team swag. Let's go. I have been waiting to talk about this. Oh, I am so excited. BYU Athletic Director Tom Homo has been named the NACDA AD of the Year. This is so well-deserved. When COVID canceled BYU football schedule, Tom Homo orchestrated an entire new one last minute. As we know, sometimes adding games literally days beforehand. In a year when everything went wrong, Tom did everything right for BYU. So this award, well, it's a no-brainer. Everyone knew he deserved this. Seeing our student athletes and coaches post about what Tom means to them, well, that just proves it. And honestly, I have to add to this too. I go to a lot of games, so I see Tom a lot. And anytime he interacts with the BYU teams, his passion for BYU always shines through. I love when I get to see this, and I always love catching up with Tom, so I just can't give big enough congrats to our guy, Tom Homo. This is a big deal. You know what else is a big deal? Scoring your highest team score since 2004. Number 12, BYU Gymnastics scored a 197.3 against number 11, Denver, in the Marriott Center last night. The girls have been scoring a 197 on the road, so I am pumped that they could do it at home for their final home meet of the season. A season team high score, new career high, seven seniors celebrated on senior night. It was such a good night. You wouldn't even think that we lost to Denver by .075. It might have been the last home meet for gymnastics, but there are plenty more games we can look forward to, especially this weekend. Number two, BYU men's volleyball begins their two game series against Stanford in the Smith Field House tonight. Now the Cardinals are 0-5 on the season, all those losses coming from top 10 teams, but historically, they're a good team. So I'm hoping for a good matchup this weekend. As for women's volleyball, the girls were supposed to play Pacific this weekend. Unfortunately, that was canceled, but no need to fear. Like I said, a lot of games this weekend. Like number 13, BYU women's soccer at Southfield tomorrow afternoon against number 23, Santa Clara. Not only is this the first game back at Southfield, but we also get a limited number of fans in the stands. Immediately following that game, those soccer fans can head to Miller Park for some BYU baseball. Our Batcats, as we speak, are in the middle of a three-game series against... Utah. All right, now time for a segment I have missed. Let's round it up. Football edition. All right, this is another one I have been waiting to talk about. The Nakua brothers are headed to BYU. You guys know these Washington and Utah transfers are legit. The wide receivers are brothers to former BYU Cougars, Kai Nakua and Isaiah Nakua. So BYU, it's really home for them. Because of that, I just want to make sure they get an official welcome home. There's been so much buzz around the Nakua brothers for BYU football, but amongst it all is buzz for spring ball for BYU football. I love all the epic posts, but I have to highlight my favorite ones so far. Passing game coordinator Fessy Satake, well, he really can do it all, folks. He's a great coach, but apparently he can hang with the boys on the field, too. These posts are just proof that the season is right around the corner. A new season means new swag, which brings me to this post. Are we kidding with this? This is just not even fair. I mean, do you have to be an athlete to get this or could someone else, I don't know, maybe a social media host who dedicates her life to talking about BYU sports, could she maybe get it? I'm just, I'm just asking for what a friend. <laughs> My crew wants it too. Guys, come on. What about us? While I wait to hear when I'll get my swag, not if, but 
when I want to wish track and field good luck in the NCAA championships. They are on day two of competing. They're wrapping up this weekend. Good luck, you guys. You got it. Thanks for hanging out with me on BYUSN right now. Go give us the follow. I'm going to find a way to get those Air Max 97s. See ya.